So here's a little recap of what happened, where we are in life. So in the previous episode, we went down into the thermal plant and tried to get that done. Now in doing so, we took down Darth Primus, Promus, Prawn, Darth Prawn, Primus, that's going to be the next one. Take a little note right there. Um, no, but we took Darth Prawn down to 1600 meters to go do this. Now, we got him stuck in the thermal plant. Now, the last season before this, we took him down and got him stuck in the plant. So, it's a reoccurring theme with the prawn suit in the thermal plant. For some odd reason, I just love leaving them in weird places. So right now, instead of going, actually no, I need to go to my base first. I'll pick up Emperor's Wrath and then we'll go down to the Inquisitor. Bring the Inquisitor back to the gun. So we can go through the teleporter and finish out the thermal plant. Now I'm not going to make another prawn suit because I feel like I'm just going to get it stuck. I realize that's a lot. But that's just the plan. So. Thank. So. Welcome back guys. To more Subnautica. Now I don't know if I mentioned this. We're also getting our purple artifacts from the base. Not just Emperor's Wrath. Because we need those to open up the doors. In the thermal plant. Now. Me being stupid last time. I thought they were orange artifacts so I made two orange artifacts which is a waste of ion crystals if they're you no know, they're called ion cubes nowadays sorry about that they're because back in my day kids they were called ion crystals um what can we move to the other side wait we probably should uh keep a few on us just in case we need to make some purple artifacts because I really don't know if I have any in here Hopefully I do, because I really don't want to use any more iron crystals. Considering I still do not have a prawn suit um, drill arm, I can't get that large resource of iron crystals in a thermal plant yet. Which is a big ass fucking bummer, and I don't know why I don't have my freaking drill arm. Yeah, we're just going to have to make some. Okay. We need two total. We have the diamonds for it, that's good. And I know I have a shit ton more diamonds on the, um, Inquis not, yeah, Inquisitor. Damn, I need two diamonds per tablet. I was not fully aware of my situation. Tablets are a check. Oh, shit. Hopefully the Inquisitor isn't 900 meters down because I max out at 900 meters. Emperor's Wrath has a little bit less damage, so we really just gonna... See? This is depressing. Darth Prawn. <laughs> ah, 1300 meters down. And it happened last season too, like, I don't know what it is with Prawn suits and the thermal plant with me. I just can't let them survive. It's just they have to die down there or be left behind. It's it's cruel, I know. Don't don't even worry about saying it. It's it's bad. 
Now, we really didn't need to pick up the Inquisitor to go do this, but it was still the fact that I didn't want to leave it so far out here, so I'm just kind of just making sure I'm finished with this excursion before I move on to the next one, and I really do not want to leave the Inquisitor down this far away, because it was like 1,300 meters away, then that was a prawns suit, I think that was... I think it was a, this was the 17. This was the 1700 meters. I'm gonna stay close to the surface. Ten meters or so. That'll do. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Two meters, nice, mate. You can't, you, you, I can't, I can't get to number one, one. maybe. Maybe. Oh, oh. Fucking talent. Can we go back to two? Ah. Stay. St Ow. Probably should pay attention to where I'm driving, not... Ah, we're three meters. That, that can happen. Two meters. Two meters. Can we keep it? Keep it. Okay, cool. Sorry, but this is a long-ass drive, and you know it. Okay, I just figured out the coolest thing in the freaking world. My shield generator is badass. That's so fucking cool. Have I taken care of three? Putting my shield generator on. Because I really don't want anyone. Turn on externals. Ah, uh, the shield generator only goes over my observatory. That's not... no. It needs to go over all of it. I want little triangles everywhere. Yeah, we got it. I don't know why the data pads reset every time there's an update, but I really don't appreciate it. Turn off. Shield off. Engine powered on. And we're on. Freaking one more thousand meters. A lot of baddies. I don't know why it's not showing up on my radar. Because they're obviously right next to me. Okay, we were at a hundred percent. Oh, the freaking shield must use a lot of energy. We do have pa uh, spare power cells, so that is good. Yeah, the shield generator must take a lot of energy. Because I don't know how I could have wasted 96. Measurements of power. In that amount of time. Like that's not possible. I mean we went to the. Lost river back and forth. Like three times before my energy was completely kaput. Now I know that's. Probably not as much as. 2000 meters. But it's still. Yeah, there's no way. Because I can go 100 meters. 200 meters. Okay, I'm waiting for one of my percentages percentages to go down. To see. 
That's 200 meters. Okay, that was 700 meters, and we still didn't lose a percentage of um, energy. So. Yeah, it's, it was definitely the shield generator. Note to self. Don't do that again. Don't worry guys, we do have some water. Those are all our used power sails. Got all our nutrition blocks. Got all our nutrition blocks from that one time they were just chilling in the... Uh, what are they called? The big baddies area. I know that's not... What is what are their what are their names? I know this. I know this. What is what is the name of the thingy majigger? Now we do have those metal spiders to deal with. So hopefully they don't kill us. But if they do, we should spawn back at um the Inquisitor. So there is that. See, look at that big old vine of resources that's just sitting there. Open, open, open. Thank you. Creepy. Rip Darth Prawn. I guess I don't get an iron crystal right there. Thermal plant. Alien ion cube data. There we go. So the thermal plant is complete besides the fact of leaving all those resources. Just out of curiosity, let's let's see. Nope, he is he is stuck. At least I'm not getting glitched into the wall this time. It sucks, man. At least we now have the portal system up and running. Now I don't know if it links up with the other portals that are around the world automatically or if I have to go specifically to those areas to turn on the terminals. Which is probably something I should figure out. Superior backing up skills. Now, out of curiosity. Is there any way to turn on these terminals? Now that we know how to activate one. 
Nope, this is not an activation L terminal. So, yeah, because there's usually a cube right here that comes up. Usually, what am I saying? Usually, that's the first time I've returned on a terminal. So, yeah. I don't know what that one hooks up to, but we do know that it's two. So, there is that. Now going back to base camp, so that's that's how we got 800 meters per percentage of power. So there's absolutely no way we would used up 96 percentages of power getting over here. Just turn on the shield generator, yeah, it instantly takes four away from me. So the combination of me turning it on, using it for, oh shit. Going all the way up, not fucking with that. Okay, so besides the need of making a new prawn suit, there's also something we haven't done yet, which is this upgrade over yonder our swim charge power fins so we just need a wiring kit I believe now let's make sure we don't have this no, it's a, we have ultra glide fins I don't know if we can now make our ion batteries and power cells yes fuck yeah so yeah I don't know if Switch, yeah, switching out my fins. They're two different fins. Okay, never mind. I don't want to do the upgrade. But I do not have the resources to make another prawn suit. Now we do need aerogel, which is what holding is holding us back. So we'll just have to uh, use these guys out here that we have because we're smart and we picked up extra resources when we were farming it for the first one because it is uneventful because my stupidity can't be helped when it comes to messing up and getting my prawn suit stuck in weird ass fucking places so Cole was smart this time and picked up his gel sacks now we need some oxide crystals which I believe we have some still left over somewhere ooh we already have some arrow gel so now there they are alright so we only need two now what's next Pristine ingots and lubricant. So let's go grab some lubricant. All right, T. One more. And I already have some pristine ingots right here. I believe we need two, but I'm going to pick them all up just in case. We also need to pick up our beautiful. I just realized something. Our cuttlefish isn't there anymore. Rot row shaggy. make sure that I wasn't going to hit my base. So I didn't want it glitching into my base. Because <laughs> that would be just my luck. Alright. 
All right. Oh, wait. We need to go over here. So our little unupgraded prawn suit is now born. All right. So Darth Prawn. Darth Prawn Mob 2. All right, let's see if that matches up. That's a lot of red. There we go, that's more like it. Actually, I think they're swapped. So the black needs to be red and this needs to be black. There we go. That's more like it. Now we need to switch the name to orange. Done. There we go. Alright, so we have Darth Prawn Mach 2. Now let's go ahead and give Mach 1 a proper burial. Thank you for your services. We're going to mark you as red as dead. And we'll turn off your beacon. Rip to Darth Prawn. Rest in peace, my friend. Rest in peace. Thank you guys so much for watching more Subnautica. If you guys are enjoying this, let me know in the comments. Please like, subscribe, do what you can do, anything else, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Deuces!